Let me show you a quick tip I just figured out on how to comfortably rotate your camera view like this for a better sculpting experience right inside a blender. So traditionally when you're sculpting, uh, you know, you can orbit around your view as, as you're used to and do all the sculpting. But sometimes, sometimes when you have to get like circular mode, say you want to do something like this, it, you know, that's not, that's not very natural for the wrist. So if you're drawing on paper or in Photoshop, it's pretty straightforward to rotate the camera view. But in Blender, it's not so straightforward. You can, if you want to, you can use shift and then four or six on the numpad. So if I hit shift four, it will like do this and it'll go in increments but honestly it's kind of annoying if i want to get up here and do some kind of sculpting and rotate this around it's kind of annoying and it, honestly it breaks breaks the workflow in my mind what i found though is there's an add-on that ships directly in blender if you go to preferences add-ons and you search for grease pencil tools now I know this sounds weird, but it's something that ships in Blender and it lets you rotate the canvas in Grease Pencil. So if I were to fire up a brand new Grease Pencil scene, I could draw something here, you know, whatever I want. Ooh, the world's worst smiley face. Grease Pencil Tools allows you to use Control, Alt, Middle Mouse button, and then you can move up and down to rotate your view. So, so say I want to get in here and I, I want to draw something like just some extra details. You can just rotate around super easily. And I was using this for grease pencil stuff, like doing animatics or storyboards in Blender, and it dawned on me, I'm like, I wonder if this works in regular sculpt view as well. It does. So if we go back to here, now instead of using Shift 4 or 6 like this, um, you can just use Control Alt Middle Mouse button, and you can very naturally rotate your camera view just using this. So if I want to sculpt, I can go ahead like that, do whatever sculpting I have to do. Maybe I, maybe I want to work down here. On it. it feels way more natural than using the other tools. Now, the one thing is if you kind of get a, a wonky camera rotation, um, it this movement is a little unnatural. So I, I wish, you know, that could be improved, but I'm not going to complain right now. This is way better than anything we've had before. You just kind of have to have to get used to to moving if the camera's weird like this. But you can always reset the view by clicking on your gizmo up here, um, or just or just using the regular keypads like one or three, and then you have the normal view again. All right, thanks for watching.